So what was your favourite memory? So my favourite memory, I, I wouldn't say I have one specific one, but I would say there's like a few that really stick to my mind, which is, I think I was 13 and for my birthday, you very kindly bought me a Ferrari driving experience, oh. which was at, um, I remember it was like every man racing circuit in Leicestershire, I think. And we went there and I, I genuinely couldn't believe my luck. I got to drive a Ferrari at like 13 years old. I think you also as well. The storyboards like, we used to make up. We, yeah, yeah, still so, have them now. So and you, uh, yeah. it's kind of funny, you know, looking at how awful my hairstyles were really at the time, but you know, it's nice no, to look back and, at the time, yeah, I thought I looked really cool. But <laughs> of course, like family holidays, you know, I'd never, I think the furthest I'd ever travelled with my, my birth family was, I don't know, three miles in the road, down the road in the car. Um, and that was very, very rarely. So to go to somewhere like Butlins was, it was unbelievable. And like obviously a completely different experience then again. And, you know, it's, it's, I suppose those moments where I got to, the world kind of opened up a little bit and I got to explore what life was, I guess. Mia, what was your favourite? I, I, there's hundreds, absolutely hundreds. Oh, really? <laughs> there was literally uh, just, Everything really, the whole the whole memory yeah. of you being with us, but good memory wise is watching you overcome your fears, I think. Since leaving us, since leaving the care system was going to your Rockstar Awards and finding oh, out you were young cool. entrepreneur of the year. Yeah. For me, honestly, I cried buckets that night. Well as you know. I know, I know. I tried, I tried to um, wind you up on stage. Anyway. But for me, yeah. it, I felt so proud.